Hey friends, welcome to 30 Inks 30 Days, day 21. The one in which I, oh my gosh, I just thought I couldn't find my glasses, they were on my head. That's fine. There's a pair over there too, which I saw. Anyway, yesterday, Havasu Turquoise, look at that. Gorgeous. Lovely. Writes nicely, too. Ooh, this is a beautiful page, isn't it? Yeah. But that's old news. You're turning the page to new news. Today, it's kind of a weird ink to do for 30 inks in some ways. Um, but we're going to do Platinum Chokuro. This is so black. <laughs> Just incredibly black. I already filled the pen because <laughs> we won't get into it. Um, but anyway, so I I'm using the uh, Oto Taske. that I got in an ink flight box. Actually, it would take this hiking with me sometimes. I think I have ketchup on my hand. I don't know, friends. How old am I? Apparently not old enough to get, to not get ketchup all over me. Okay, so we're gonna write, yeah. I've been having issues with this pen writing well. I think I need to floss it. Um, anyway. But let's do this. The box is such a, like, beautiful presentation. And it's slanty. Like the uh, Karen Dash boxes. But the Oh, look at it. Hmm. Oh, I had, when I filled my pen, because, so, basically, what I, I filled it in advance because I was filling a converter, or excuse me, a cartridge to put in this pen, and I'm glad I wasn't filming because I grabbed the cartridge to fill it, and what I didn't know is that for some reason, I had a cartridge that didn't have a bottom to it so I put the ink in and it just came right out the other end of course because there was nothing to stop it there was some swearing actually I may have avoided swearing but I thought about it as I think you could understand if all of a sudden a very 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 black ink is going places you didn't want it to go <clears throat> aka on your hands on surfaces that aren't meant to be inky. So there's that. This has like, this bottle has a built-in ink miser type thing. It's really nice. Um, it's funny, I don't really use black ink. I mean, I have, it turns out quite a lot of ink, so why would I need black? But I guess I felt like, well, if I'm going to have black, might as well have the blackest black. And I was intrigued because I thought, like, how black is this ink that everybody's like, whoa, that's black. It, it, yeah, it's, it is. Whoa, that's black. <clears throat> it's so dark. Anyway, so this is. A thing I don't like about this pen, though, is this, I find it too heavy back here. I'm just like such a princess in the pea type person with their pens. Although with a pen this short, does this help? Yeah, this is a nice way to grip a pen this short. Platinum. Chokuro. Um. Oto 
Tuske. This doesn't have a nib size written on it. I'm going to go with fine. I did think this was a good choice for this combination in the sense that if I wanted a pen to have like black ink for it in it for a while, this would be a good one. And also, so bright. You wouldn't want a necessarily, I wouldn't necessarily want a broad pen with an ink this dark. Although, I don't know, like look at it. It's like it's absorbing all light, which I suppose is sort of, exactly what black does but anyway move on <laughs> okay I don't write as well like because I don't hold my pen that way quite as frequently so we'll go back to awkward hashtag 30 inks 30 days June 2024 ugh Day 21, is that right? Yeah. Pink. Platinum. Cho. Kuro. Pen. Oto. Tasuke. Fine. I'm gonna like dip this nib in water. Maybe that'll help. It's just driving me bonkers. I do think maybe there's some fiber in there, but I don't know. It isn't because it's used. I filled it and wrote with it last night. So it's not that the cartridge uh, didn't have time to saturate the feed. It has had a lot of time. Now I am nervous about doing a spot with this ink. <laughs> not gonna lie I'm nervous about this and I also got for my other swatch card rather than using my paintbrush because I did do that but that was such a pain to clean how is there water on it's fine that was such a pain to clean that um I'm, I got a, a, a cotton swab to do it with instead because it's not going to be the same, but like y'all, it's, it's black. <laughs> it's, not, <laughs> it's not an ink that we need a super thorough <laughs> sw swatching of to see hmm, what colors are in here. Hmm, black. That's what colors are in there. Okay, so I'm setting up a splash zone. So I put a thing here to hopefully help us not have the splat go everywhere. But um, it's it on top of the syringe, which is about to pull. Okay, ready? I'm glad I did that because there is stuff going. But I'm also not going to turn this paper. I'm going to turn in the paper would be better than trying to shoot in different directions. But it's fine. I can't tell how much zinc is on here because it's absorbing all light. The directions for the zinc are like, use only deionized or distilled water. Or do I have supplies for that? So just uh, taking my chances. It is so black. <laughs> if you can get yourself a sample of this, I recommend it just so you can experience when everybody's like, y'all, this ink is so black. <laughs> so you can see why we're just like, wow.
I'm now doubting myself that this is by platinum. Like, because I've written it too many times. I got a fair amount on there. I think this should go. I'm curious to see if this works. If, if, um, or if the cat won't appear. There's a part of me that thinks it, it, it is just going to stick to all of it. <laughs> so we'll see. Oh no, it's resisting a little bit. And I think. It dries actually pretty quickly. So this is dry. So we'll do this. Just a teeny bit. Will that be enough? Almost. This is going to be like probably the day that sticks out maybe the most as like a, one of these things. It's not like the other. <laughs> that and somehow pink. <laughs> or maybe because it's so neon. <clears throat> anyway. It's been Chocoro. Just look at it. It just, it's so black. Look at how black it is compared to the box it's in. Just for, like, this is a black box, and this is it's just so, so black. <laughs> I haven't found anything else. <laughs> and it's just, anyway. Get over it, Maria. Okay, okay. Look, it's already dry. I don't remember it being a dry writing experience in the first pen I put it in. I don't remember what that pen was. I think it was a Twizzy. I'll have to look back and see. <laughs> but I won't. <laughs> I would have to if I was choosing to, but I'm not. Anyway, so it's resisting a little bit. What if we help it? I'm helping. Yeah, there. Little, little bit of help there. Okay, <laughs> that's enough. So have you tried Chokuro? And if you haven't, do you have a favorite black ink? Do you ever write with black ink? I know some people are like, I refuse. I'm in fountain pens, I have a million inks. Why would I write with black? Um. And some people have um have favor blacks because uh black inks because they'll do um like line drying and then do watercolor ink wash over it. So they want a waterproof black ink for the purposes of that. But anyway, let me know if you have experience with this or with any other black ink that you really love. Um anyway, I hope when you're watching this you're having a wonderful day. Take care of yourselves. Bye.